E60 bodies are unusual in that all front end parts, spars, fenders, hood, etc., are made of aluminum alloy and attached to the metal frame of the rest of the body using rivets and special glue. The use of winged metal made it possible to achieve better weight distribution along the axis than its predecessor, which improved driving performance. In addition, aluminum parts provide better corrosion resistance. However, there is also a negative side this metal is extremely difficult to straighten, and in case of body damage, the parts are most often replaced entirely. And they are expensive, even second-hand ones. When buying a used E60, be sure to check the geometry of the body on a diagnostic stand, this can be done at a specialized BMW service key if there have been cases where emergency cars were hastily repaired and put up for sale, not wanting to deal with expensive repairs. Mechanics advise inspecting the niche for the spare tire, in some cars the trunk lid seal lost its seal, and water penetrating inside eventually flooded the micropower module of the multimedia system installed there and rendered it inoperable, while the central monitor does not work. There is also a battery in the trunk, when replacing it, it is recommended to install only the one recommended by the factory. A battery with other parameters must be registered in the electronic brains of the car, otherwise electrical problems may occur. Compared to the impressive external dimensions, the interior of the 5 is not very large. The tightness of the landing is felt more strongly in front due to the massive dashboard and the high casing of the central tunnel of the body. The gallery is more spacious thanks to the reclining seating position, the back of the rear seat has a corresponding angle of inclination, and in some versions there is also plenty of legroom at the back of the concave backs of the front seats. But it's uncomfortable for three of us to sit there, the middle passenger's legs are hampered by the wide central floor tunnel and the protruding armrest of the central tunnel. Visibility is problematic only when moving backwards, due to the high stern the rear clearance is not visible. Of the interior trims offered for the E60, leatherette turned out to be less wear-resistant, the driver's seat side bolster is the first to deteriorate. I have good news for you. Now, if you are planning to buy a used car, or learn more about your car, you no longer need to search for the information you need on the internet. We have collected everything in one place for you, on the website carme.pro. Here you can find out everything about the car, what brakes and at what mileage, any problems with engines, chassis or gearboxes which trim levels are better not to mess with and how not to lose money buying a used car. You will learn all this on Carm.pro. 5 will delight you with rich minced meat. Among the unusual options, we note the iDrive system, control of internal equipment using a rotating joystick near the handbrake and a keyless engine start system with the start-stop button, on versions since 2006. The 5 has a wide range of engines, in general, all E60 engines contribute to the driver's character of the model, they provide decent dynamics for such a rather large car. Thus, one of the most common 2.5-liter engines with an automatic transmission accelerates it to hundreds in 8.7 seconds. Used car components can also present unpleasant surprises. In E60 engines, oil leakage may occur from under the valve cover gasket, oil pan, or rear crankshaft oil seal. Problems have also been noted with the cooling system, leaks of the cooling radiator, failure of the fan, and in N-Series engines, since 2005, failures of the thermostat and pump equipped with electrical stuffing. The ignition system is equipped with individual coils, which were not reliable on M-Series engines, until 2005. After 150,000 kilometers, problems can arise from catalysts, which will be indicated by the check engine light. E60 engines are equipped with a proprietary Bivanos variable valve timing system. It requires the use of high-quality oil and timely replacement. Despite the factory-recommended replacement interval of 20 to 25,000 kilometers, for trouble-free operation it is advisable to change it every 8 to 10,000 kilometers. The timing of all five engines is driven by a metal chain, which lasts a long time. The attachment belt is changed along with the rollers every 60 to 70,000 kilometers. Most of the fives are rear-wheel drive cars. However, thanks to electronic active safety systems, driving the E60 on slippery roads is safe. 
In our country you can actually find all-wheel drive modifications of the Xi, the production of which the Bavarians returned to in the E60 generation. The front axle in the Xi is connected using an electronically controlled multi-plate clutch that can flexibly regulate the amount of torque transmitted to the front axle. On older Xi, there may be problems with the CV joints of the front axle shafts, increased vibration, and with the clutch electric motor, oil leaks at the junction of the motor housing and the transfer case. Many E60S are equipped with automatic transmission, manual versions are rare. The manual transmission is reliable, which cannot be said about the automatic transmission, see summary. The chassis is stiff, but not too harsh. It is tuned for active driving and fully meets the BMW slogan, driving pleasure. To reduce the weight of unsprung masses, the suspension parts are made of aluminum alloy. A double lever design is used at the front, and a three lever design at the rear. Stabilizers are installed on each axle. We have versions with the dynamic drive system, which uses active stabilizers that change the degree of rigidity, thereby increasing the vehicle's stability during sharp maneuvers and cornering. As operating experience has shown, the hydraulic motor of the stabilizer, usually the front one, fails over time it loses its tightness, it is replaced as an assembly. Weaknesses have been identified in the front and rear suspensions. Parts will have to be changed on average every 50,000 kilometers. The rest of the consumables last much longer, silent blocks and ball joints of the lower front control arms can last almost 200,000 kilometers, replaced as an assembly, and rear ones 150,000 kilometers, rear stabilizer struts about 100,000 kilometers. The brakes and steering may be a problem, there have been cases of leakage of rack seals and knocking noise due to wear of the gear rack pair. There have also been cases of rotting of the electrical wiring of the pressure regulator valve and the servotronic power steering, changes the degree of gain depending on the speed. The malfunction manifests itself in difficult rotation of the steering wheel. But the steering ends can last about 100,000 kilometers, and the rods can last even longer. The 5 in the E60 body is an image car designed to emphasize the status of its owner. It has not lost the main concept of BMW models and, even in used condition, is capable of giving the joy of dynamic driving. Driving this car is a pleasure. But the car creates not only positive things, with high mileage, failures of certain parts are possible, the repair of which costs an amount corresponding to the level of business class models. Therefore, before you dare to buy a used E60, you should carefully weigh your options.